Yes, it's that time of year again. We're down at the Toronto Boat Show. I'm here with DT Power Sports in the Boat Warehouse, and we have a number of boats set up on the floor. I'm really excited to get to show them to you, so let's get going. So the next stop in the Lund booth is the Lund Alaska. Now it's been fully redesigned this year, and it has some exciting new features that I'd love to tell you about. The Lund Alaskan comes in a number of different color options, including fall marsh and wetlands camo. Long known as the workhorse of the lineup, has seen a number of different new features this year, including wood-free construction, updated consoles, live wells, improved rod storage, and increased horsepower capacity. If open concept is your jam, then this Alaskan might be the model for you. The Lund Alaskan comes in three different sizes, the 1675, the 1875, and the 2075. It also comes in three different configurations, the Tiller, an SS, which is a side console, or the Sport model, which has a full wraparound windshield. So new for 2024 is a complete wood-free construction. That's in the flooring, it's also in the aluminum uh, storage, as well as the transom, which is full composite. Anybody familiar with Alaskan models of the past will see that the side live well has actually moved to the back, and for a number of good reasons. It redistributes the weight for you, as well as gives a better ride for the fish and the opportunity of a larger live well for those big fish adventures. For an open concept boat, the Alaskan offers an enormous amount of storage. This starts with a bow and the storage up front that's just enormous. As we move forward, you'll see floor storage up in the front. You'll see that the live well movement has allowed for open concept storage on both sides with hangers for four rods on both the port and starboard side and compression rubber that will keep everything dry and sealed. Last but not least is storage in the back close to the driver where you can keep extra paraphernalia and stuff that would normally be cluttering up the boat. 